Punctuation tip for EG and IE. There are a few Latin terms that are still commonly used in English, including the abbreviations EG and IE. Some confuse EG and IE. The abbreviation EG is from the Latin exempli gratia, meaning for example, periods come after each letter and a comma normally follows unless the example is a single word. Even on pages listing the names, e.g. this page, that example is used. The abbreviation e.g. is typically used to introduce one or more examples of something mentioned previously in the sentence and can be used interchangeably with for example or such as. The Summer Olympics is composed of a variety of sports, e.g. gymnastics, swimming, and tennis. Because EG may sometimes imply examples omitted in a list, do not use the Latin abbreviation etc. in the same list. The abbreviation IE is from the Latin id est, meaning that is. It is used to mean therefore or in other words. Periods come after each letter and a comma normally follows. In every case, angle 1 was greater than angle 2, i.e. every viewer perceived a circle. A good tip to remember the difference is that i.e., which starts with an i, means in other words, and e.g., which starts with an e, means for example, i, in other words, e, example. For more punctuation tips on written English, please like us and subscribe by clicking the bell icon. If you should have any questions or comments, feel free to post them in the comment box below. Thank you for listening.